Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel Gora Ramek IT. Recently, one of our clients faced a situation where their Office 365 subscription was suspended due to declined credit card payment. After that, they have started getting an error called AADST TS500014, which is related to Outlook connection issue. And Outlook could not connect to the Exchange server. So we followed few steps to resolve the issue. And this video, we will walk through this, those steps to solve the problem. So let's jump right into the video and solve the problem. Okay, to solve this problem, first we have to go to the search bar on our Windows machine. And inside the search bar, we have to type work and school and that will come under the settings so once you click that it will show you the all the accounts which are connected to your system so as you can see here i have a couple of account so i'll select the one which is having trouble so i'm selecting the first one and trying to disconnect it so in your case just find it out which email id has a problem select that and disconnect this uh, account and make sure that you are go with the correct one because once you remove this uh, um, the other account then you have to re-add it right so uh, for my case this account was added twice so i have removed the first one and now it's the second one same account second time i've just select that and click on the disconnect so it's going to disconnect the account from our system and it will take a while to disconnect it don't worry about your data everything will be as it is your outlook data everything will be as it is it's nothing going to happen with your data it will be in, on your online account okay so once done just close this uh, account close this setting option and then what we have to do is let's open this outlook account and see whether you are your problem is solved or not so as you can see here still outlook is says that it's trying to connect you can see the bottom and the uh, bottom right it says that trying to connect and uh, we have to wait here we have to wait here to see whether it's connecting or it's throw some error here so i don't see a progress here it's still trying to say to connect and you can see it says that need password so you can double click double click on that need password and once you click that need password it will show you the pop-up where you have to add this uh, uh, username and the password i mean in fact the password for this account make sure that you key in the correct password here so let me add the correct password okay so i have a password copied in my clipboard somewhere so i just pasted here and click on the okay and here you can see i'm still getting the error but this time the error is different it says that auto discovered did you notice that so it didn't solve the problem so what we will do is let's close this uh, outlook account close it completely and after closing that account we have to go to again we have to go to this work and school account again um, if that is not showed up then you go to this word don't go sorry so don't go to this school and all click on the word and inside the word you have to go to the accounts and you can see left hand side bottom click on the accounts and inside the account you have to sign out it says that you still your account is added here just sign out from your word account not from the outlook just from the word account and then you just make sure that your account got disconnected or removed from the microsoft word here right if you click on the top of your account profile and then once you do that just close this outlook account close this microsoft sorry word account and now it's time to go to work or school again in the settings make sure that this account is removed from here from here also we have already done that but just to verify it once again and once you do that it's time now it's time to go to the credential manager so in the search type the credential manager and after typing the credential manager you have a two option web credential and windows credentials so click on the windows credentials and uh, scroll it down and make sure that your account the email account which you have deleted from your machine should not be here so we should be if it is if it is there we should remove it from from here also from windows credential right so idea is to remove this uh, all the traces from this account and we'll re-add it or anything which is cached will be removed here okay that's done now it's time to close this uh, microsoft teams and then re open the outlook account again to just to verify if uh, things are working good so 
I'm reopening my account. I can see that uh, this uh, email account is already added here. We have not removed the email account from our Outlook. And uh, here you can see that it still says that need password. So now let's try it once again. Just key in our password here, email account password here. And now here you can say that allow my organization to manage my devices. So click on the OK and it's trying to add the account and here it says that there's something went wrong and uh, click on the done so nothing no issues click on the done and you can see here it says that connected to the microsoft exchange and you can see all my emails are all the clients emails are started syncing here one by one so that's a good sign that means it had resolved a problem but but wait we have to verify it whether it, there is a problem with there should not be a problem with SMTP. SMTP means sending the emails. What we will do is we'll send the email to one of this. Uh, any you can send the email to any of your colleagues and verify it. So we are this add this uh, test mail here, and after that, in adding the test mail, just send it to your colleagues and ask them to acknowledge it. So here we sent email and we'll wait for his acknowledgement and here we go here we go we can see we have received the email acknowledgement right so that's it that solved the problem for our today's issue so that's it for today's video if you have any questions query or any feedback related to this video please do let me know in the comment box thank you very much for watching the video